In the latest episode of College Hill on BET, a heated altercation unfolded between Amber Rose and Jocelyn Hernandez, resulting in a significant clash. However, BET made the decision not to broadcast the complete footage of the intense confrontation. During the episode, tensions escalated as Jocelyn Hernandez confronted Amber Rose, accusing her of supposedly aspiring to be white. Amber, infuriated by these remarks, approached Jocelyn and a physical altercation ensued. The cameras abruptly stopped recording at that moment. Viewers who tuned in to witness the confrontation between Amber Rose and Jocelyn Hernandez have voiced their opinions regarding the outcome of the fight. According to some fans, Amber gained an advantage by delivering the initial blow, leading them to believe that she emerged as the victor. However, without the full footage being aired, it remains speculative to definitively determine the winner of the altercation. According to their accounts, although Amber Rose managed to land the initial punch, it was Jocelyn Hernandez who ultimately emerged as the victor in a notably intense manner. In an interview, a cast member revealed that following the initial punch, Jocelyn took control of the situation and forcefully propelled Amber's head through a glass window in the classroom. The incident marked a significant turn in the altercation, showcasing the escalating intensity of the confrontation. According to the cast member's explanation, Jocelyn seized Amber and forcefully threw her backward, proceeding to repeatedly slam her head against the glass window until it shattered. This vividly illustrates the escalating aggression and the extent of the physical confrontation between the two individuals. The decision not to broadcast the complete footage of the intense altercation on BET raises questions about why the network opted for a more limited portrayal of the incident, despite the potential explosiveness of the footage. The reasons behind this choice remain undisclosed, leaving fans and viewers curious about the network's decision-making process and the factors that influenced their decision. An agreement was reached not to broadcast the footage or allow any cast members to discuss the incident. This approach aimed to mitigate the risk of a lawsuit and maintain a level of confidentiality surrounding the events that unfolded. Speaking anonymously, the two cast members shared their insights regarding the incident at hand. They chose to withhold their identities while providing information, possibly due to contractual obligations or personal concerns. So what are your thoughts like share and subscribe and thanks for watching.